Hey, what is up? It's Tony, the Driven Dad. Welcome back to the channel where you can follow my journey driving a Tesla Model Y to make a living. In today's video, um, I'm going to talk about my earnings on Lyft today. Um, I wasn't planning on doing a vlog today, but um, I just I, I needed to share what's going on. Um, so far, I've done four trips on Lyft. Two of them Lux, two of them Lux Black. I'm at $333.03 on four trips. And basically, four hours of work. So, um, and part of that four hours is just sitting there waiting for a trip. Uh, I did have the app on, let's see. I did have the app on for a little while just while I was charging. So it's uh, online. I'm four hours and 51 minutes. And um, I don't know what the active time is, but hey, when you're working on some stuff on YouTube and you're charging and you can still make $333 and eat, let's just say it's five hours. That's pretty good stuff. I'm gonna continue to test out this uh, Lux and Lux Black only option. Maybe I'll uh, even try just Lux Black, but um, I don't know. I, I kind of feel bad that people are ordering these Lux rides and um, I have a couple of repairs still pending on this car. And uh, so it's, it takes a lot of customer service skills, we'll just put it that way. I still have a 5.0 rating and um, people are asking me for my card. So, uh, and I'm not dressed the part either, I guess, you know, so that has me a little self-conscious as well. I just started, basically it's a uh, 1.20 p.m. Um, last night, uh, which you'll get a little bit of a uh, I'll put that video in either before or after this, but um, I made 400 and something dollars, like $450 on six trips, um, all Lift Lux or Lift Lux Black. So um, today I needed to get a couple of little things out of the way. I had to get like a pool noodle <laughs> to set up my desk in here. Um, so when I'm charging, I can have a workstation and then, um, I got myself a square reader so I can take payments for, um, private trips and, um, got that all set up and now I'm good to go on um, that lift black stuff yesterday. Um, uh, I did make a few contacts. I'm, uh, I've got to print out some cards so that I can uh, give out my information and uh, start building out some clients here in the Denver area and um, that way I'm not 100% reliant on the gig apps so that's what I'm doing right now um, first trip I'm three minutes 1.2 miles away well the first request came through I went to go pick them up and uh, they no showed it was a trip that was ordered for their friend and uh, they never showed up. They told me if uh, the time runs out and they never don't show up, just cancel the trip. So that's what I did. And uh, final little piece of housekeeping here. I am using the GoPro again right now. I have um, I've gotten a process option available to me now so that I can uh, edit uh, off the GoPro a little bit easier uh, than trying to download all that footage from the GoPro to my iPad. So uh, we'll test that out with this video and see how long it takes. And um, thank you everybody for watching the video that my wife did. I appreciate that. And um, keep 
leaving her comments you can click on it right here and uh, go check that video out but keep leaving your comments if you'd like to see her on the channel more often All right, drove, dropped off that passenger. I had to pull over and do an identification check on my account. So I had to, on my left account, I had to scan my driver's license front and back and then let it scan my face. All right, getting a trip eight minutes away, regular lift. Um, so right now the goal is to stack up some lift rides until it turns into uh, party mode and then I'm going to switch over to Lux and Lux Black only uh, because if I'm going to do party mode I might as well get paid extra and most of those people are not rowdy. Sometimes you still get the rowdy ones ordering the uh, luxury modes but I just don't vibe too good with those people. Um, at least at the time of day that they're, or the mindset they're in it at that time. But so right now I am trying to stack up some rides to get the at least the first level of the bonus, which is like $146. And we'll see how it goes. All right, welcome back. Dropped off that person. Um, that puts me at trip number 29. And um, out of 56 so we'll see how far I can get up on this uh, today uh, I'm not too worried about it uh, chasing these bonuses right now because of how I've accessed this uh, Lux and Lux black strategy I'm working on I, I really got to test out test things out over the next few weeks um, seeing how often I can do something like that and um, get away with it. So, $146 challenge is what I'm working on right now. All right, check out that view of the skyline from the west to the east. So there's no mountain backdrop on that, but that's pretty cool. Right on, dropped off passenger number three, $33.60 right now, and I am waiting on the next trip. I'm working my way back south, um, I'm thinking of, I don't know, I've got 26 trips to do to get this bonus. So. I might just park over here by this parking lot, uh, shop shopping center off of Colorado, and wait for another trip to come in. All right, just got another trip. Been parked at the parking lot. I mentioned for about two minutes, um, just got a Lyft preferred ride, which is Lyft's version of Comfort. So I'm gonna get paid a little bit more, not much. But, um, yeah, I'm going to head to pick them up for a minute, four minutes, one mile. All right, quick update. It is now 526. I ended up at nine trips, $91. Was downtown, made it back to Highlands Ranch from downtown with um, three ladies having a dance party in the back of my car. Uh... And uh, so I let them have the iPad so they could select the music and everything. Uh, they tipped me all their extra ones from their drag queen show. Um, I don't know how much. It's pretty full <laughs> of ones. So now I'm on my way to pick up a Lyft Lux. I've switched off um, Lyft regular and it's just Lux and um, Lux Black right now. I've got a $3.75 bonus on top of this pickup, so about eight minutes, 5.1 miles. Time to catch up on the earnings doing these luxury rides. Back at it. Um, 
up to, I guess my last update I said I had nine trips. It was eight trips because I've done two now. Um, I'm at 174 now. So I almost doubled my total for the day in two trips. So uh, there's a lot of surge going on, but not right where I am. I'm headed back towards Park Meadows, and uh, that seems to be the spot I like to stage at. You can get luxury rides anywhere, but um, just preferring not to be downtown right now. Prom is going on, and I don't want to end up with a bunch of miners. Um, it's a little bit easier to manage in a suburban setting than in a downtown setting. So headed away from there, rolling through Cherry Creek right now. Potentially could get um, a trip probably by the time I turn the camera off. All right, so I think I just tried to update you guys on uh, photograph. So anyways, I am on my way to pick up another Lift Lux. I am uh, off of 225 and I-25, and I got this trip seven miles away. Now I'm now, now that I am updating you, um, I'm six miles away right now. And I was just trying to say that um, I declined a couple of Lux rides on um, going downtown they were in downtown or Lakewood and I was just not in a position where it would be very easy to get to them time wise it'd be like 25 minutes and I don't have trip info so I don't know how long of a trip it would be if it was a Lux Black I would have taken some chances on those but it wasn't it was just regular Lux um, doubled up on my money almost uh, well actually I have doubled up because I got some cash from uh, the first of the last two trips. So in two trips, double up my money from the eight trips that I did on regular lift. So uh, five miles away, gonna try to, hopefully Lux category stays busy and isn't um, too crazy of people. And I'll continue to do these and maybe I'll get this bonus even on uh, running the Lux categories. All right, it's getting dark. Um, I'm up to $206 on the app. A uh, bunch of cash also. I am on my way to pick up another Lux and I'm about 4.5 miles away. Got 96 range, so hopefully they're not going too far. Um, and then I definitely need to charge up. All right, got this Tesla to 254 miles. That costed nine bucks. So I got a Lux ride 3.6 miles away. And I'm going to go grab that and then uh, see how things are going after that. All right, well, wrapping up the night, charging up right now, and 402.67 is what I made it to, and uh, whatever cash I got in there. Today is Sunday, 1226 p.m., 63 degrees in Colorado, a little overcast, one week before Mother's Day. So, got to take into account all of these things in order to plan the week. <clears throat> so, um, last night I ended up why people think that they get the right-of-way when they're all right sorry about that so people running their left turns when they don't have the right-of-way 
So, anyways, when I schedule out the week, I'm planning to take off Mother's Day. And um, right now, it's been two days of Lift Lux and Lux Black testing. Um, right now, I have it on only Lux Black and Lux right now. Um, but I'm probably going to um, swap that so I can get at least this bonus taken care of. Um, haven't had any any rides come in yet today so um, just getting the day kicked off wanted to say hello and um, get you guys involved all right uh, welcome to the office got my desk set up got the stream right your rodeo going um, I'm not in the chat because my signal two bars um, got Lift running Lux and Lux Black, editing a video, and uh, got the podcast going on in my ear. So, welcome. All right, I just dropped off a couple to the Southwest Plaza area, so I'm charging up here at this free charger instead of Park Meadows. Still have Lux only running. I'm trying to finish editing this video. I am also listening to the live stream so check out my setup right now so yeah I'm uh, wrapping this video up hopefully I can't tell how many more clips I got but then I'll release that put regular lift on that's all all right quick update um, I've edited a video uploading it right now youtube says processing will begin shortly so who knows how long that'll take hopefully it'll get out by 7 p.m now um what i've noticed is sunday does not seem to be busy like the rest of the week or rest of the weekend on lux rides um the surge in general is pretty low so I went ahead and turned on full, um, all of the categories and I am still charging over here at Southwest Plaza. So 510, 216 mile range. I've added 29 miles to the range while I've been sitting here. And, um, I guess while I wait for another ride, I can start editing the next video. It is now 5.37. I got about eight minutes into the video edit and then um, just got a lift request. It's a long trip, 45 plus scheduled. Um, considering I'm over here by Ken Carl, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that this trip is going to the airport. I could be wrong, but pretty sure that's where I'm going so that'll get me pretty close to discount charge time and uh, I'm I mean I'm not doing too bad on mileage right now 228 miles uh, but going 45 minutes in this next lift who knows what I'll be at but it's been a pretty laid-back day as far as making money goes uh, I'm only at $56 I will um, hopefully get some more trips going after I drop this person off because I, I have a hundred and fifty six dollar bonus to hit with only like six or seven more trips to go so pretty close might as well knock that out and uh, not leave that money on the table wrap the week up won't quite be at 3k but you know um, I definitely didn't go hard this week. I was trying to tinker around with some strategies and stuff and um, finding out that Sunday is not the best day to just sit and wait for a lift Lux. Got those uh, people to the airport, got a person out of the airport, came down here to charge, planned on uh, 
updating the vlog, but just now got to it. It's now 8.21 p.m. I've got four trips left, and I'm on my way to pick up a Walmart Spark. Um, so I'm going to go grab that, five items, $26. And then I think I got one more of those to do for a bonus. So let's go get it. All right, welcome to the Walmart Spark walk along. I've got Pedro's stream going on, the other phone in my ear. Here, let's start this. All right, so we got cheese, we got. All these cards suck. All right. So one, two, three, four, five, six items. Let's get it. Grab one of these. Thank you. So just see how that says the aisle and the section. So I'm gonna go 15 is, I'm in 15. So section five, back this way. So section five, see these things at the top here? Those tell you the section. So Frito's original. 9.25. Popables. Section 2. Salt and vinegar. Five ounces. Yep. One, two. All right, Let's see how easy this is, section nine. Get this cheese, and I think we'll be done. Nope, four items left. Sometimes you gotta wait in line. Scan the barcode. So 
you want to proceed after you exit so that way you don't get in trouble they can check your receipt but uh, sometimes it usually let me start these and check these orders here curbside one order ten dollars All right, so now I'm on my way to this person, uh, five miles, nine minutes, and I accepted two other offers, their curbside pickups, um, from the Highlands Ranch, Walmart. So um, I'm, I think this one was $26 and one was $38 and the next one was like $22, so about like 80 bucks and just I'll probably get it all done in about an hour so not too not too bad and then I gotta finish up this uh, lift bonus so uh, interesting day so far All right, so drop that order off. Obviously you saw that. On my way back to the Walmart, 10 minutes away, five miles. Then that, this next one's the 20, whatever, $28 one. So 30, 16, 9. I'm gonna make about a hundred bucks. So um, try to get this done before 9.30, get the uh, rideshare stuff done and then go home. All right, I just picked up uh, the curbside, the first one I um, accepted. I am 3.2 miles, seven minutes away. And then I'm on my way back over to Walmart to pick up the next batch. All right, dropped off order two, it's 9.22. So it's going to be a little bit more than an hour, but about to make a hundred bucks on Spark in around an hour. That's freaking phenomenal. All right, just uh, dropped off the first of the double batch on my last set of Walmart Spark for the night. So it's going to be a hundred dollars in about an hour and a half. So. Um, on my way to the second drop off, it is seven minutes, three miles. All right, um, I forgot to mention, while I was picking up this order, I uh, called in to talk about the rideshare question on Pedro DoorDash Santiago. Um, so yeah, uh, my opinion is that do what you need to do in order to make the money you want to make and be cognizant of the cost that it's going to cost you as far as maintenance goes and fuel and car payment, insurance, um, rental, whatever way you're doing this. Like, just make sure that you're actually making money while you're doing it um, and just because you make a thousand doesn't mean that you made a thousand you got to take into account your expenses balance everything out and see what you're going to take home and then you know you got to put aside your your money for bills for or for like the maintenance bills on the car the taxes all that so be financially aware of what you need to take out of your gross pay before you say you made $1,000 or $2,000 or $3,000, whatever it is. I know I post my numbers and that's all gross, but my goal this month or this year is to make 100000 net pay. 
that's the goal all right well um, about 1.5 miles away from this drop off then we're gonna hit the five lifts hopefully it doesn't take forever and um, knock out that 146 bonus and end the night so I can start off early tomorrow all right I uh, had two people cancel on me hopefully this person doesn't cancel on me I've still got four trips to go it's 1041 um, just really need to get these trips done so I can get home hopefully I can get these done by 1230 so I dropped off that passenger uh, time to head on back to the charger and wait for the next passenger uh, there was some surge going on. I was about to go chase in uh, Parker and I'm literally right close to Parker. So it went away. So I'm just going to head back to the charger. Got 191 miles. So let's get that charge going. Well, well, well. I was going to do like a little update when I got to the charger standing outside the vehicle but I don't know if you can see that it doesn't look like it the GoPro kind of sucks at low light let me turn off this interior light maybe that'll help but it is raining it's sleeting it's possibly hail I don't know but um, anyways I've got one trip to go, 55 out of 56. It is now 11.42, so if I can get this one trip and it be a short one, please be a short one, um, then I can head on home. Um, I know last week on Sunday, I ended up in um, Superior for my last trip with a Lyft Lux, so it was like $56. So. Anyways, I am... 10 minutes from the charger hopefully I can get a trip before I get to the charger otherwise charging up and I don't think I'll be heading to the charger after the last trip I'll just go home unless the last trip happens before I get to the charger all right I just got a trip it is now 11:56, so um, I only got up to 197 mile range so it looks like I'm gonna end up uh, coming back to the charger anyways uh, depending on where this person's going might determine where I'll be charging at so um, I'm picking them up from the hotel the Hilton so sometimes uh, those are quick short trips because they need to go grab something or other times it's like hey uh, my flight's leaving at 2 a.m. and I need to go to the airport so we'll see all right so wrapping up the night it is now 12:25. I've got about 20 minutes left on the charge and it, turn off these stupid windshield wipers while I'm charging and so I am ending the night at 385.68 uh, tips pending so um, I will that's the thing with Walmart is um, I guess that's just gonna have to count towards next week's totals um, and then I'm going to add in all the tips um, that I got for cash and um, I'll add that in for the weekly recap. So thanks for clicking on this video. If you haven't already, please hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed to me and you're watching me for multiple times um, and I'm showing up in your feed, you may not be subscribed. Check if you are, if you're not, please hit the subscribe button. And um, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, leave those in the comment section below. I'll respond to pretty much everything uh, as long as I see it. If I don't respond to you and you have a question, just 
do another comment so that I get the notification and I will respond. And th once again, thanks for clicking on this video. I hope everybody has a profitable day and remember to stay driven.